goats have their unique uh, requirements and one of them is good fences. It takes a net wire fence for the most part uh, to keep goats confined in the areas you want them. Uh, we have markets close by uh, and in this particular location predators are not a major problem yet. Well, we're standing in front of a, what we call a bump gate and you don't actually bump it, you can open it up by simply driving through it. You could have a cattle guard, but goats can walk a cattle guard. So you have to have something more substantial than a cattle guard. The gate has to be free swinging. You can use cable or chains to uh, hold up one in, end of it. And the uh, distance those chains are situated or cable situated down the gate will determine how uh, flexible that gate is, how easy it is to push open. You don't want it closing too quick because it can close this too quick, it could do some damage to the vehicle. The hinges are just uh, cut from a piece of pipe that has a larger diameter than the, than the pipe that's holding the, the gate up. Sometimes in really high winds, it can blow this gate open and so there is a potential to latch it under high windy conditions, for example in the springtime, but normally we don't latch it. It'll, it'll automatically close.